One of the number one questions that I'm always asked is, when can I come back? What do I need to do to come back? And what takes place? Re-entry into the city once we have been under a mandatory evacuation truly depends on the state of the city and do we have the infrastructure to support those citizens? Do we have hospitals up and running? Is the infrastructure for utilities established? Do we have enough power that's being supplied to the city? Do we have good clean running water? Those things are the factors that we take into consideration with regards to bringing people or allowing people back into the city or lifting the mandatory evacuation order. We understand and we empathize with our citizens knowing that they want to come back home and to see if they have a home coming back to. And so we are generally working around the clock to ensure that you can come back home and safely view your property to make sure that you have it. You also want to be aware of generator safety. In this area, so many people become so dependent on generators and it never fails when we have these types of storms. We have tragic deaths from people who are using generators indoors. We try to put out a lot of information, just reminding people don't use them indoors, not even in a garage, don't use them near windows. When they need to be out in a well-ventilated area, you wanna keep them in truly in a well-ventilated area away from where they can cause any type of harm to your family or even to your pets. 